Today we're going to prove that the derivative of the natural log of x equals 1 over x. And to do it, let's first write our function as y equals the natural log of x. Now, to find this derivative, we can rewrite this formula in another way, because we know that the natural log is the opposite of the exponential function. So, we know that e to the y equals x. This is a very famous identity between exponentials and logarithms. Now we can take the derivative on both members, so d over dx on both members. And for the first member we can apply the chain rule. So this is d over dy of e to dy times dy over dx. And for the second member of the equation, well, d over dx of x, this is simply equal to 1. But now, d over dy of e to dy is just e to dy, because the derivative of the exponential function is the exponential function. Then we have times dy over dx, and this equals to 1. Now we are interested in dy over dx, so we can bring e to dy to the other side of the equation. So dy over dx equals to 1 over e to dy. But now, what was y equal to? Well, y equals the natural log of x. So we know that dy over dx equals to 1 over e to the natural log of x. But now e to the ln of x simply equals to x because it is the function of the inverse function. So we finally get that dy over dx equals to 1 over x. And this is our answer.